What is good YouTube, it's your boy Trill. We're gonna jump straight into the best controller settings for Black Ops 6 on console or on PC. Let's get it. All right, so first, I'm gonna have y'all go to y'all settings. Boom, we're on settings. I have my sensitivity on stock, number six. Six is fine. Um, before I was playing on Omni Movement, I'm not gonna lie, on console, I was playing on five. But six feels good on here. It's like the perfect spot. I could probably bump it up to a seven. Um, five would be a little too slow in here. I tried it before already. Um, controller vibration off, dead zone inputs. I actually been meaning to try a new one out. I saw one where um, your Omni movement can kick in sooner, the lower the dead zone you have. So I'm actually gonna try um, 60 out. Um, I've been playing on 99, it's been fine so far. I'm gonna try this out and see how this goes. Cause I want my Omni movement obviously to like, be fast as fuck boy. Anyway, um, so yeah, left, max is gonna be 60, minimum 40. Um, right, minimum four, max 60. Y'all can copy what I have here. All right, next, on the aiming. Sensitivity, these are my sensitivities I have set up on mine. Um, ADS multiplier, I have 0.75. It is fucking flawless. I mean, like, it's perfect for control and recoil. I don't know what it is about it, but when I have it down that low, um, recoil comes really easy to, to control. Um, target aim assist on from controller, so obviously. Um, movement. All right, this is where follow through pay attention tax sprint assist that's what we're gonna run um sprint assist delay so when black ops first dropped people talked about how it kind of felt a little clunky i could see what they mean on stock settings and everything not being tweaked in this yet but like omni omni for me is like it's down to a t should be even better with that newer lower dead stick minimum that i'm maximum that i set for myself i'm gonna try that out here in a game or two all right for your sprint assist delay um zero you want none none at all on on mantle assist off keep that off sideways on mantle cancel reloads yes it, it helps for getting out of sticky situations sometimes if i thought i needed to reload enemies there pick back up again keep moving cancels the reload i can still shoot them with like 17 bullets i left in the clip whatever um automatic and everyone I actually need to turn this off that'll help with cutting out animations for you in the game um and you just character would actually move faster believe it or not Follow through, follow through, match whatever settings I have here. And then I wanna go to the advanced portion. All right, so that you aren't sitting there clicking down on L3. Put this first setting here on hold. Thank me later. It just way smoother, way faster. You don't have to try and activate attack sprint assist to run none of that shit. It's just way easier. Follow through on all my settings here. I'm just gonna go back. I don't think, think I changed anything on vehicle wise. Jump over to combat. Uh. Follow through, make it match. Um, tap to interact, where's it at? Here we go. So you know I'm not holding buttons down anymore as action buttons. You don't have to sit there and hold it. I hold X or hold Y to put on place in the third, this on the third. You don't have to do any of that hold anymore. You can just tap the button once and boom, your character's on it. Prioritize, interact. That's what you want. Um, What else, what else, what else? Uh, that's pretty much that for that one. Now we're gonna jump down to, oh shit, wrong button, graphics. PC has a few more options, we're on Xbox, so bear with me here. We're gonna go with the console settings and see what we can change. Um, quality, blur off, weapon blur off, um, field cast on, on, field cast on, 100%. All right, to help minimize packet burst, you can follow these settings here. Um, optimize auto on daily limit one gig. Boom, good on that. Um, view. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. I don't know what it is, and I don't know why the fuck this does this. I don't make video games. This is just what they give us. Field of view. Take that shit from 90 default. Sucks ass. Don't do 100. Don't do 110. Don't do 115. Do 120. You might have to sit a little closer to the monitor. Sure, to see everything. Whatever. 120. The, the, your fucking character moves faster. Don't know what it does or how it all is affected. Just, just pay attention. All right. ADS view affected weapon field of view wide thank me later vehicle field of view wide thank me later first person i think it comes on 50 percent. if i could do less than that i would but console's limited to 50 is the bottom number um inverted flashbang turn it on you can see easier after you get flashed um what else and audio wise that's it that's it that's pretty much it um also, I heard some people have problems with footsteps and other audios in this game, and that they're really faint or don't hear them at all. Make sure your console is set up and prioritized towards headphones, and make sure um, 
your in-game settings are also set towards headphones. All right, y'all. Y'all have a good one. I'm going to fuck with your boys later on. Peace.